This is Ray Mancini's first fight back after his title fight loss to Alexis Arguello two months earlier. Uh, he needs the winner to, to rebuild his confidence. And his team picks the right opponent in Manuel Abadoy, who comes in with a record of 18 wins against 12 losses. Uh, he does have a win against a spoiler in Gerald Hayes, but Abadoy has been knocked out by the likes of Andy Gannigan, Johnny Sato, and Blaine Dixon. And uh, in doing some research, his post-fight remarks, as translated through an interpreter, are always the same. Quote, they stopped the fight too soon. And you can expect the same reaction here from Abadoy, as he's strictly an opponent here against the power-hitting Boom Boom Mancini. ...out of character with Ray Mancini, and let's see if he listens tonight. An important step back for Ray Boom Boom Mancini against Manuel Abadoy. Mancini very relaxed a couple of hours before the fight. Very confident that he could make the comeback. Not concerned that that loss to Aguilo would hurt his confidence. Well, it'll be important to see how he do against Alexis Arguello. And he'll want to do it tonight against our, uh, Abaddon. Good left hook by Mancini. Mancini's last two outings have been lengthy affairs. 14 rounds and 12. He has uh, Abaddon in the ropes now. The two slopping punches. That one landed on Mancini's elbow. And from Mancini's standpoint, what he's got to be concerned about is the right hand from Manuel Abaddon. Abaddon has 19 KOs, and uh, many of those have come courtesy of that straight right hand. And uh, the best way to prevent that is what Mancini is doing right now. Stand inside and smother Abaddon's punches. This is where Mancini wants this fight to be, against those ropes. That's a little 10-round lightweight bout. Wild right thrown by Mancini. Now moves in and lands a good solid left and a good left uppercut. Good right by Abadoy. Daniel Abadoy out of the stable of fighters on the West Coast that Jim Montoya has. And we've seen Montoya fighters on our cards before. They're all very aggressive and they all come to fight. Good left landed by Mancini. Wild left by Abadoy. That left to snapped Abadoy's head back, but he stood there. He didn't move backwards. 20 seconds left in the first round as Mancini lands another right, Rod. Now, if this fight is fought at close quarters as it is now, that's a big plus for Mancini. He wants to be in close, fighting off Abadoy's chest. And so far, uh, that's worked out well for him in this first round. And the first round comes to a close. We're talking with Dave Wolf, and uh, he wasn't so sure we are going to see 10 rounds of action in this one tonight. Both have come out very aggressive. Mancini felt he had let his family down in the entire city of Youngstown when he lost to Aguilo. <laughs> That's a lot of pressure to put on you, Ben. But he certainly gave a, a good account of himself against Aguilo. And uh, many people thought he won. Boom is landing to the midsection and to the head. There's another good right to the body. thrown by Abadoy, takes a right to the jaw. Well, you still got to be leery about that right hand from Abadoy because it, it is a punch that can stun him, especially when you're coming forward if you walk into it. I think at this point, the only thing I think Mancini might want to do more of is set things up with that jab a little bit. He's got a good jab, big left hook, and that shook Manuel Abadoy. He is taking some incredible left hooks from Ray Mancini. These are good punches and a good right. Right and a left and another good right in the corner. And this is Abadoy's corner. Mancini dealing out pretty good punishment. A left landing on the jaw. Right is wild. But he keeps landing left and right in close. Wild right thrown by Abadoy. Left jab. Wild left by Abadoy. And again, Mancini. Deciding exactly where he is. And it looks like it's going to be all over. Larry Hazard stops the fight and a happy Ray Mancini. A very impressive comeback victory for Mancini. That's Murphy Griffith, his trainer. Emil Griffith's uncle, a well-known name in boxing. And there's a happy Ray Mancini, a spattering of blood under his nose, but he doesn't care. He, he used that left hook and a good right hand to knock down Manuel Abadoy. 
gets an embrace from his manager, David Wolf. A very impressive win for Ray Mancini. Mancini came out smoking and really not very let up. Well, he was very aggressive in this fight without being wildly aggressive. It was a controlled kind of uh, situation for him, and that's exactly what his management wanted. And uh, we have to be, uh, his corner men have to be happy with that work. We're going to get to look at a little bit of that action. Ladies and gentlemen, the time of this bout, two minutes and eight seconds of the second round, and a winner by knockout, Ray Boom Boom Mancini. Mancini. Ray Mancini, a very impressive start back toward what he hopes will be another shot at a lightweight title, and he's got a big bout coming up after the first of the year that could lead him directly to another title bout. See Dave Wolf, his manager, congratulating him, putting his big arm around him. And there's a boxing team that uh, could be destined to big things. You're Murphy right. Griffith on the right, Ray Mancini in the center, and David Wolf, author turned boxing manager, uh, on the left. And uh, those people have got a very impressive uh, start, and they've got a good thing going. And if they can continue it, they may well get another lightweight. They may get a lightweight title. Okay, we'll be back with a chat with Mancini in just a moment. So don't go away.